is asking, do you see COVID variant disruptions later this year? No, I don't. I don't see um, New York could do a crackdown. So could L.A., but I don't see the, the economy shutting down. They can't really shut the economy down without pushing us into a full blown depression. We're already in recession. Europe's in a full blown recession. China's in a full blown recession. That's already been announced. I mean, essentially, any economic analyst worth his metal will, will, has already stated that, that the numbers are dismal. Um, they could push the US into a full blown recession, depression if they did any lockdown. So that's the first thing. Um, but that does not stop the mayor of New York enforcing everyone to, you know, wear a mask indoors or doing something like that. So you have to realize, like a lot of people from California, New York, keep asking me over and over about COVID. The rest of the country is, you know, people will say, William, why do you answer these COVID questions? We haven't been dealing with this for over a year now. Right. Because in those particular cities, L.A. particularly uh, and, and New York. They're constantly imposing COVID this, COVID that, COVID, COVID. It's like in the paper constantly. So uh, you have to realize this is this is becoming more about political control and leverage. But I don't see, I do not see any lockdowns happening. Zero. Uh, whether they impose mask, uh, you know, that will be in certain districts, certain states, certain parts, certain cities. But I do not see any lockdowns. I do not see them imposing vaccinations, right? Enforcing vaccinations. I see them backing off of that. I see the CDC losing, you know, a lot of political power. Um, no, so I, my answer keep is it's, you know, I've been saying all year so far, we're not, we're not going into lockdown and we haven't. So I don't see any variant disruption this year. I think they're trying to do the monkey pox and all this other stuff. That's all failing. But what I do see is them trying to, um, enforce mail-in ballots through some COVID variant. Um, but I don't see that succeeding either. So I, I think the real issue has to do with what's coming with the economy and what's you, with the Ukraine, with the food. I think the real issue is the food crisis, the food crisis that's coming, particularly going to hit Europe and the Middle East first. Then it's going to hit China. China needs food and oil in order to operate. It, can, it does not produce enough food and it produces no oil to operate. It produces very little of its own oil, its own energy. They need massive amounts from the Middle East and uh, food from, from Russia, from Ukraine in order to feed their population. So China is on the verge of an existential crisis as well. Join the next Ask Me Anything session in the Global Transformation Astrology membership. Go to gta.williamstickevers.com and become a GTA member today.